Hello everybody on YouTube, Jamji here, back with a new video and a new series called Stardew Valley. I understand that not everybody would like to see this like playthrough, but I'm 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 content with my own. As long as I like it, in my opinion, then it's good. Uh, let's make the hair color a bit darker. First, we're gonna. Um, Create a character. Uh, I have brown hair. I am gonna keep. I am gonna have a cat. My name is. Huh. Oh, whoops. There we go, GMG. My farm name is gonna be called. Hmm. What should we call the farm name? How about... <laughs> no, we're not going to do that. Um, Jack's... Farm. Yeah, my, my grandpa was named Jack. There we go. And my favorite thing is sweets. Don't know if that's spelled correctly, I don't care. Um, I'm gonna go with the walls because I like those. Um, hmm. Hilltop. No, I'm gonna just go with the standard farm because. Meh. That's, I haven't played it enough yet to be good enough for it. Oh. <clears throat> and for my very special grandson. I want you to have this sealed envelope. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Now listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. And your bright spirit will fade before growing emptiness. Over oh, dramatic, but okay. When that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. X X years later. Just so everybody knows, Grandpa, he's dead. He gone! <sighs> Sorry. Oh, I'm yawning. There we are. Working for Joja. <sighs> I like this. <laughs> wait, wait. The second next booth, there's a guy dead. What? Wait, what? <laughs> no, no one's gonna clean that up? What? <laughs> Envelope. Dear Jamji, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belonged. I've enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy. Jack's Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start a new life. You, your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Let's get right out of here. Sorry that uh, bleh, sorry that there's no music. I'm actually uh, I was actually I shut off the music because yeah, why did I? 
I think it was from the back when I played it myself. Hmm, looks like the bus broke down. Hello, you must be Jamji. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Why am I putting on an accent? Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your revival. The farm is right over here, if you'll follow me. Why did I put on like a really fucked up accent? <laughs> the story. <laughs> Whoops. This is Jack's farm. It looks like shit. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. <laughs> Easy for you to say. It's not you that has to do it. <sighs> oh, there we go. And here we are, your new home. Ah, the new farmer. Welcome, I am Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. Oh my god, this is gonna hurt my fucking throat in the end. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house, very rustic. I don't know why I'm trying to put on a, like, a, like, a Russian accent. Rustic? That's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt, though. Rude! <laughs> Don't listen to her, Jamji. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. <laughs> anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The town's people would appreciate that. Oh, and I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. And definitely not look through my windows. Well, good luck! In some ways, I can understand why it looks like shit and st Okay, let's be honest here, it looks pretty bad. Why does it? Well, obviously, the reason is pretty obvious. Move. Shift isn't run. That's bullshit. Hey, got some pear snips. Let's see, got some quests. Uh, yeah, yeah. Introduction, meet everybody. Let's go out and start by planting everything. First, let's remove an area where I can actually do stuff. I have been playing a little bit, not 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 a lot. Not, I haven't been going crazy yet. Um, I wanted to save it for YouTube. Actually, this game is one of the reasons that I actually began, became interested in the game again, like in, in, in the YouTube game. That made as much sense as I actually hoped for. <laughs> The plan is to clear out this little corner over here to start out, and uh, then over time I'm gonna remove more and more of stuff. Um, I could probably cut the video here, but I really don't want to. This is a full playthrough. Time to cut down a tree. Oh god. I can't wait to get some good upgrades for my tools, because this is fucking... Horrible. Oh yeah, you I can't remove yet. Let's, do, 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 do. Uh, let's see. Um, yeah, let's do it from up here. We have to be careful that we don't use all our energy before we've been able to water these and stuff like that. If we do that, we can end up losing a lot of money that way. Oh yeah, right, I don't have an upgraded can yet. 
I was trying to hold it down to like charge it up so I could water more plants at once. Didn't really work that well. There we go. And now I'm gonna use the rest of... Actually, let's go and buy some more crops. Because that's actually a thing I always do early. Is buy crops. The good ones. Don't buy the... Don't buy pear snips. They're so bad, they don't give any income. I only planted those because I got a bit, like I got them for free. So they can give a bit of free money, but that's the only reason really. Oh, hello. Hello, mailers. I'm not gonna go into, like, getting relationships with everyone right away. I am gonna meet people. I'm getting some supplies for- <clears throat> No, I can't use that one. I am getting some supplies for this alone. Perry's got the good stuff. Hey! <laughs> no, I can't do this. It's so fucking stupid. Uh, okay, let's see. What should we get? Um, we could get these, but I think cauliflower gets... Give, yeah, I'm gonna get cauliflower. There we go. I can't get a lot of them. But that's not the point. The point is just they can give a lot of income compared to what you can do with pear snips. Either way, I would get more money by planting these than buying a lot of pear snips and plant those. Plus, I wouldn't have the energy to take care of that many that many plants in one day. So it's more about like thinking of like how much energy you have for one day. Uh, we need one more. Boom. And if anybody goes fucking haywire on me, like, Oh, you're doing it wrong, you should do it like this. Well, I don't care. I haven't played the game enough at all to know what I'm supposed to do most of the time. Let's get some, uh, let's begin clearing out some of this stuff. That's like the goal right now, is just to clear out everything. Um, new stuff grows up, grows all the, all the time, but that's not the point. Every, like, month that it changes, new stuff shows up and you have to remove it. But the point is right now that I'm just trying to clear it out as much as I can. Oh, there we go, there we go. Cut down another tree so I can make a... So I can make some, um, chests. So I can have a storage space for all this because we don't have any inventory. Oh yeah, we can do this as well. Oh yeah, um, these mixed seeds uh, usually give like good stuff. Look, this time it gave me. I think this is. Um, yeah, we got another cauliflower, which is really good to get that early like that. That's nice. That's nice. Um, crafting. We need more wood. Wood is needed. Um, I should have enough energy to cut down one more tree, I think. Ooh, it's gonna get close. Good, good, good. We're almost there. There we go. Got it. But do I have enough wood to actually get a chest? Yes, I do. Good, 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 good. There we go. Do, 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 do. Just a temporary solution. Um, now we're gonna use most of the day to go around meet people, get that quest done. I know it's not a real quest, but I also want to f find like random stuff around. It's always a good idea to find. Oh, new person to meet. Sad it. Oh. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. Oh. Yeah. Got that. Hope you'll find your own work equally rewarding in time. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, sure. Bye. I would love to be able to, like, farm. Like, be a, a really big farmer here in Denmark is pretty... Pretty common. Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny, if you like. That hurt my fucking throat. Okay, need to calm down on this. Okay, first of all, I need to turn down the music just a little bit. I want it to be in the background, not not 
fucking blasting into my ear for fucking five minutes. Well, we've been into town, meet a few people. Let's go back and uh, yeah, let's. Uh... Oh, hello. Hello. Hey, pretty bird. Hello, you must be Jamji, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. Why am I putting on accent all the time? What the fuck? My husband runs the general store here. Ah, oh, you're me Fuck off. No, nope, don't want to talk to you. Bye. <laughs> what? Don't look at me like that. <laughs> ah, perfect. Um, a good thing to do is collect these if they're around because you can sell them. Don't give a lot, but they give something and early game something is always nice. Boomdy. There we go. We do have a bit of energy. We can remove these two pieces of stone. I'm starting to feel exhausted. Yeah. True. Let's put those in there and then go to sleep. There we go. See? Only 30 gold. Not really the biggest amount. But, um, yeah. Might as well, right? Plus I can get my... Um, I can get a like try and get experience inside the one where you collect stuff. Oh, hello. Hello the, there. Just got back from the fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometimes. I've got something for you, Willy. I don't know if I should like go and meet random people, especially a guy called Willy. Why am I saying that? That's not nice. I'm sorry. Everybody that's called Willy, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please, don't hate me. <laughs> Let's go. We're going to water these. Uh, then we're going to go down to the beach. And check out what he was talking Like, go down and say hi. Uh, after we've met him, we're going to come back. Clear out some more of this area. Not all of it, because we can use the trees at some point. Especially the... Um, what do you call them? The seeds for the trees are really good. Because you can connect three different kinds and then you can make a snack, which gives you energy so you can do more work. <laughs> which is the only really reason that I want to keep it. <sighs> Sorry, I'm a bit I have a bit of a cold. <laughs> so if I'm snur if I'm doing this <laughs> sometimes, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's willy for ya. Ahoy there, son! But you uh, was a newcomer in town. Good, good to finally meet ya. I'm giving him the accent, okay? I don't care. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out of the salty seas. Okay, no, forget it. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Yeah, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive and hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Damn straight, really. I like this character. It's probably one of the characters that I like the most. Just for the sheer fact that he... You, you get like a feeling of a soul from him when he stands there. There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Just listening to him like gives me a sense of enjoyment. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. Also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what my old papa used to say. Anyway. This is why I like him. In my opinion, he... Like, this character has soul. And not a lot of characters have soul in this game, in my opinion. Way too few have, and I know that it's there. Let's not go and do anything about that. Time to do this. This is called scavenging as far as I remember it's called that. Um, but it basically gives you a lot of XP to, like for um, a specific level up and you get better better stuff every time you uh, pick up stuff the higher level you are in it. Actually maybe I, c I should be able to go in. Ah no not social. Skills there we go. It's called foraging. And if I get it up to a certain, if I can level it all up all the way up here, it would be nice because then you only find good stuff, like the stuff that's more valuable. I think there's four stages. There's the normal ones, then there's the silver kind, then there's gold, and there's iridium. I think it's called. It's purple, basically. And it's better to find better, better stuff every time. 
I am going to keep these because they are going to be uh, useful later on. <laughs> Actually, no. Maybe I should just sell them. Ah, fuck it. I can find more of them. They aren't that fucking difficult. Um, uh, what can I craft? Wood path or stone? Yeah, I need my stone. See, this is something I learned to do. Like, I would recommend doing this if you aren't that great at... Let's say you're not very really great at... At like, oh, I don't, I'm only gonna use this area right now, so maybe I should, like, for example, I'm gonna do this, which is gonna mark out the area that I'm gonna be using. Oh, what the? There we go. This is the area I'm gonna be using uh, early game, and that's the area I'm gonna keep, uh, keep bleh, that I'm gonna keep clean from all uh, stuff that's gonna grow. I don't know if it's actually gonna stop them from grow, from grow, from growing. But I am gonna, um, I am gonna do this. Ju it's a, it's an easy way of like, just marking out the area. Like, oh, this is the area that I'm actually gonna be using. I know a lot of people are like, well, why don't you just do it better than that? Why don't you just clean out most of the stuff? And I don't like doing that. I I, I like having a foresty area. Also because a forest is pretty nice to have in a f real farm. It reminds me of Denmark actually a lot, this place. I'm definitely be call being called a nerd somewhere in the world right now. You just wait and see. You, you see. It's, good, it's a good idea. Or oh, good, uh, good idea and good idea. It's probably more... Ah! Geode. A geode is what you can find around, and then you can, um... You can basically get them cracked open and find stuff in them. They're pretty good. I don't do it right- I don't really use them for anything right now. There we go. So, I've c this area where this is in, that's the area I'm gonna keep clean. This is the area I'm gonna be using right now. The rest isn't gonna be used. Yet. I am gonna expand it out further and further as I get higher level. Um, well, let's go around and see some more points of the world. One of the p more important places to um, think about... Oh, wait. If you find these worms, you can find stuff. Usually you don't find stone all the time. You find books, you find actually pretty rare stuff sometimes. Uh, this is a... Uh, let's not get to that yet. There's gonna be a time for everything. And we're gonna get an intro to that building at some point. Oh, hello. Yoink. Ah, here's another one. Yoink. Hi, Linus. How you doing? I like this guy. I feel like he's a... Oh, we can't get to the mine yet. Can I help you? No? Okay. Well, where can we go then? That's the mine up there. We need to go... I, I usually go there whenever I don't have anything to do. I usually mine to get further down, get more minerals, sell stuff. Get more money. Get dudes, actually. I do. I get dudes. Dudes. <laughs> Geodes. I get a lot of those. Hey, that rhymes. I usually get a, a ton of them and then I just go down, crack them all open. If, if I find good stuff, I sell it. If I find more specific collection stuff, I go to the guy down here, the archaeologist. Welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeology Office. Uh, this is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for display. But I'm hoping to re remedi re remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? There we go. Says I have to read this book before I can go play. Oh. I'm tutoring visiting yesterday. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. 
you're tutoring them, not... Jesus Christ, okay. <laughs> well, actually, a teacher can make the giant difference. Hmm. Wow. Let's collect that, and let's go and sleep and say that was it for this episode. So guys, I'm gonna be trying to um, play this a lot, probably. If there are other games you would like me to try, please uh, tell me about them. Um, if there's not, then I'm just gonna pick games that I like and play them. Yeah. Let's throw this in here. The stone we're gonna keep since I don't have any more stone at all now. Uh, yep. So everybody, that was all for this episode. Like and subscribe for more, and have a nice day.